very big thank you tonight to Mournsall, who are the sponsors of this particular gala dinner. A round of applause for them. Thank you. And a big thank you to the four platinum sponsors that have been so influential in making this conference such a success, and we'll be paying a bit more tribute to them later in the evening. There's no doubt that given the feedback from all the delegates that have been involved at this particular conference, CORE 2008, that it has been a resounding success. Rail is absolutely fundamental to our future, fundamental to us being able to deliver an efficient transport system. And we're absolutely so pleased that we've got um, the degree of technical expertise within this country to make sure that rail will get stronger and stronger. We just need to make sure that we've got the passion in government to allow you to do your work. Thanks very much. The first award to be made this evening is the Contact Mechanics Award. And I'm uh, delighted to announce that the winner of this year's award is Mr. Minna Hanna. Through the relationship between microstructure and mechanical properties, the analysis investigated how these characteristics may affect the onset of rail contact behaviour. I'd like to make a special thank you to Peter Mudden, who sort of mentored me through this thesis and through the work. Thank you. The next award will be the Young Railway Engineer Award, which is offered annually. So it's for young engineers who have reached a demonstrated level of achievement and involvement in any field of railway engineering. The awardee is Mr. Sakdirat Kawanrawan. I couldn't be here without the support from industry partners, including Clinton Rail, Rail Corporations, Austrac, Pendle, and Rockla. Those people have helped me a lot in thesis development and so on with expertise and equipment and also financial support. Again, the prize today doesn't mean I'm better than anyone here. It's just I have been given a great opportunity and I really, I'm really grateful for that. Thank you very much. And now I'm delighted to announce uh, that the outright winner of the Industry Award in uh, 2008 is the John Holland Rail Division for the Middlesbrough Road Rail separation project in Melbourne. This project involved the grade separation of the busy double track Belgrave line and Middlesbrough Road by some eight metres. We're able to pull together and deliver a project that, as you, you rightly said, uh, people thought couldn't be done. And uh, it, just, it just proves the, the power of teamwork, the power of uh, a can-do attitude. So I'll leave that with you. Uh, it, it's what we can do, and that's what we need to do when we haven't got time to do it. Thank you. Now we come to the announcement of the winner of this year's RTSA Individual Award, perhaps the most prestigious award that we uh, that we offer, I think. Uh, this award is made in recognition of a person who has made an outstanding contribution to the railway industry. And it is my very great pleasure to reveal that the recipient of the 2008 RTSA Individual Award is Dr. Martin Murray. <laughs> Amongst Dr. Murray's principal achievements, have been the development of courses in railway business and engineering and railway management operations and safety and more recently the establishment of the Master of Engineering Railway Infrastructure Programme at the QUT. But I should thank Engineers Australia of course and RTSA for this weighty award and uh, of course uh, the railway industry that I've worked with for many years now, particularly Queensland Rail and uh, Rail Corp and ARTC, who've provided some uh, terrific opportunities for, for some really fun research. 
which has been marvellous. So many thanks to all of them and to you and to all this mob up the front here. In recognition of his impressive academic career and valuable contribution to the industry, the RTSA is pleased to bestow upon Dr. Laird life membership status of the Railway Technical Society of Australasia. I wish to pay tribute to those who served starting 30 years ago to form the National Committee of Railway Engineering. I also pay tribute to those, uh, including George Erdos as president or chair of the group within NCRE that formed the RTSA and others. I am grateful for the opportunity to have been able to serve the RTSA in its formative years. May RTSA long continue you know, to assist the industry and if I may say so, we have lots more work to do. Core 2008 have, has really given us a solid base and uh, um, you know, I've mentioned over 35 individual uh, either people or groups and they've had to be pulled together. Um, they've been pulled together by John Goodall uh, and his organising committee and I'd like John and Marjorie to come up to the stage. I'd like to give them a special presentation. I'm told this one's Marjorie's. So thanks to the, everybody that's assisted and supported the conference. Uh, it's been a pleasure for me to uh, put something back into the industry that uh, I've enjoyed working with for so long and probably for an industry for, for many years has been uh, somewhat unsure of its role or its value, but I think an industry that is now having its day in the sun. Thank you very much. Thank you.